hey guys so this is going to be a travel vlog i'm going to take you guys along with me on how i traveled from patakos to bunny for the very first time so basically if you don't know your girl is from Bonnie local government area in River State. And I've never been there because I was born and I was raised in Akwaibom. So this was me basically vibing in the boat ride that was going to take us to the jet sea where we're going to book our flying boats that will now take us down to Bonnie local government. I was super excited. Like, I can't lie. But at the same time, I did not know what to expect. I was a bit anxious but you know it is what it is i was set for the road and it was during the hamatan period so it was extremely cold i had to put on like a very comfy outfit i had a hoodie a pair of dimming pants and my crocs so that was it so just vibing vibing you know i didn't know what to expect because i was like you know i'm going to cross the river for the first time i was like Oh my god. I don't even know how to explain the feeling, right? But that was it. So I was like waiting patiently to like get there. So I've actually heard a lot, a lot about Bonnie. When people ask me where are you from? I'll say I'm from Bonnie local government. They'll be like, Oh my god, oil and gas city, oh all oh, that, you know, I've heard a lot. People usually hype up the place. Like Oh, you've never been to Bunny. Oh, I've been to Bunny and all of that, right? So me, that is actually from Bunny. I have actually never been there. So we now finally got to the jet sea, and then we had this guy help us carry our luggage, and then he was directing us to the flying boat we we're going to use. We we're going to sit rather. So we're just walking, walking. I was actually video. I was trying to capture everything but i had to like go 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 i didn't really have so much you know nerves <laughs> but i i did my best i recorded enough so when we finally boarded the flying boats we were seated and then we were set for the road like i was so amazed like the water the environment we had like by the sides of like the big river, right? You'll be seeing um bushes, I think mangrove. So we got to a point where we had like storms and all of that. My tummy started telling me we now finally reached. See, this clip doesn't even justify what literally happened because it was hectic, the worst feeling ever. My tummy was turning me, I felt like throwing up. But this was me just trying to explain explain my pain I, it was not funny so we finally got to the local government i had to take bike to where we had to like go and board a hotel room where i would stay for the meantime later that day i came out to watch masquerades i just love the culture that's something about it it's very unique it is very unique. They were dancing, walking around barefooted. Just the rapper itself is beautiful. I was watching from a distance, just observing, you know. So these guys. I think there was somebody here carrying a port with some fetish things inside. It's just so amazing having to come and watch a cultural background. The songs they were singing, everything was just very, everything was looking so amazing to me. So later that evening, we had to go back. And then there was this particular masquerade we had was very wicked. This masquerade better not catch you because it will beat the living hell out of you. The name of the masquerade is Okwema. So I just watched for a bit and then people were running when my school is coming people were running i ran i just had to leave that place because it was not very comfortable so i finally got back to my hotel room this like a snippet of what it looked like and that was it so i had my beat and i slept the next day i was already exhausted i came out took some pictures i was feeling myself mm -hmm. see fine girl now you know the vibe you know the vibe 
So we had to leave, and then we were just seeing different masquerades this particular morning. This was like the red and blue masquerade. We were singing masquerade. We were walking in front, and then there is like always a guy that has to control the the movement of the masquerade with the masquerade still. Doesn't be holding a rope behind the masquerade and be controlling the movement of the masquerade. So that was it. So with their drums barefoot again. And I feel this is like something this is something very significant. When they're carrying the masquerade, they walk barefooted. They're just playing music and then they passed. Then from the left hand side, another masquerade. They had a clash with another masquerade. This masquerade looks very beautiful. The raffia and everything. Yes, that's the tale I was telling you about. The man holding the tail and controlling the movement of the masquerade. They had a clash with another masquerade. But I think the other one they had a clash with was a bigger masquerade. So the red one had to step down for the black masquerade to pass. So it's just very amazing to watch because that means there is like a higher power or something there. So the black one passed. I was watching. It's just so beautiful, honestly. The culture is so beautiful. And they usually used to find the masquerade. I think it gets very hot in there. Inside the inside the raffia, yeah. So they used to find the masquerade to calm down. Probably that's the reason. I don't know. So this one is another group of people. They were very plenty. Male and female people were here with their drums and they were walking barefooted as well. So I enjoyed my stay in Boni and we had to head back. So I passed the Bunny National Grammar School. That's it there. That's the Bunny National Grammar School. My dad normally tells me stories about this school because this was the school he attended when he was in Bunny. Yeah, because he was raised in Bunny. So, yeah, I had a very nice experience. I would grade it like probably... 8 over 10 because it wasn't really very bad but at the same time I didn't have high hopes on what to expect so everything was enjoyable to me so I finally had to rest, I had to rest this masquerade passed I think he was exhausted because we are walking very slowly we are walking very slowly so that was it this one is another group of people. Like, I was just seeing series of different masquerade. I think it's people's play. They call it play. So the different people have the different play. And they use dry gin to do some incantations. And, you know, before...